Okay, I get asked this question almost as much as bid ask or order type questions. Not as much, but it's real close. So if you like my stuff, go check me out on YouTube on Capital Advantage Tutoring. Check me out. Okay, now short interest. We have to talk about that, but before we do that, we do have to talk about shorting. So shorting stock or selling short, whatever you wanna call it, is the act of borrowing shares from someone, selling them in the market to get the money, hoping it drops in price so they can buy it back for less and give them their shares back. It's easy stuff. Now, short interest is every month or twice a month, actually, FINRA, the regulatory body for, uh, for broker-dealers and all that, and agents, um, reports the amount of shares that are short, percentage-wise, of the outstanding. Outstanding is how many shares are outstanding, all the shares trading, that's the stuff. When you hear about how big a company is, that's what they're talking about. Now, short is what percentage of that is short. 25, 30, 15%. So those are people who short the stock. What percentage of it? Not who they are, but what percentage? So if it's going higher and higher, more people are shorting it. 30, 40, 50, 60%. But you would think since it's bearish, shorting is bearish in general, the higher the short interest, the more bearish it is. But it's a contraindicator because since shorting is such a short-term thing, funny, you, when you short it, you probably can have to buy it back somewhat quickly. So the more people short it, the more buyers there are eventually because they're gonna come around and buy it. So a lot of people watch this as an indicator and when they see high short interest, they start buying it like crazy, hoping to create a short squeeze force up. So the, if they bring the stock up, but they force it up, then what's gonna happen is all the people who sold it short are gonna start buying it to stop the losses and then it creates an avalanche of panic buying. This happened in early 2021, I guess almost a year ago. GameStop, GME, not a great company. I mean, they sell games. I mean, it's nobody goes in there. But all these hedge funds are shorted so much that they hated it. The actual percentage was 136%. That means there were 36% more shares short than actually out there in trading, which was crazy. So on Reddit, the Wall Street Bets people became diamond hands. They started buying the shit out of it because they were pissed off that these hedge funds, like fuck the hedge funds. So they're buying it and they went it from $20 to 30 to 40 to 50. And all the hedge funds who shorted it at 20 had to start buying it back. And that created up. And then the Redditors, Wall Street Bets started buying it even harder. And it went up to $500 and all the hedge funds were buying it at 300, 400, 500. All the people who were short had to buy it up there and they lost tons of money. And that is short interest. Hopefully that helped. Check me out on YouTube.